Hello and welcome back to another video and this time we're going to do a check of my settings when it comes to TCS and the recording content with VR. Uh, a lot of you have seen that I've been struggling for some time when, uh, when it comes to get the best results uh, and uh, I think I finally have sorted it out. As you can see on the screen this is from DaVinci Resolve and the picture you are looking at uh, are the content that you are receiving from DCS when you record in VR. So from this you need to apply a few settings to uh, have it looking a little bit better because no one wants to see the black stuff around. So you need to zoom and you need to crop to get the result that you want. So we're going to start off with this. And as you can see, it's a huge difference between uh, what you're receiving uh, from DCS and what you want to end up when you publish it to YouTube. You could, of course, stretch this surface already in OBS. Uh, I do not actually want to do that because I want to have the flexibility to do it directly in uh, OB uh, DaVinci Resolve afterwards. So that's why I'm not doing it directly in, uh, in OBS. So, we're going to go back and see how this is done. First of all, what you need to do is not to have OBS in the background or anything else, but you need to come down to your NVIDIA settings and open up. And at least for me, this was something I needed to do because I couldn't push my resolution any higher than already was and my maximum resolution I had was 1920 times 1080. So I have put it up to four times and then I can buff it up to 3840 which is going to give me a good result and from there it's much easier to crop the picture into the format that you need for YouTube without losing too much information. And then for reasons unknown to me, I actually need to start my reverb in 1920 times 1080. Otherwise the headset is not going to start and it's going to throw an error code to me. Uh, there's probably a good reason for that. So what I need to do, first I need to start everything up so that we are in uh, my maximum setting, uh, which is done 1920. And after that I can buff it up to 3840 uh, without the headset actually disconnecting. Uh, I'm not going to do that now because I don't know exactly what it's going to do with my recordings. But anyway, that's how it's done. After that it's just straight into DCS. So this is how it looks in OBS when you open up a DCS. And here it's important that you check that you have the correct site in the output. So the canvas is going to be 3840 times 2160. That's actually the only thing you need to do unless you have other things that you need to set up in the OBS. So we're in DCS and this is what you see when you record unless you're going to stretch the canvas so you don't have the black around. Now let's head over and see how the end result looks. And this is how it looks in uh, post-production from uh, DaVinci Result. And I've of course added a little slight touch of sharpness to uh, make the uh, text a little bit more crisp. But this is as good as I managed to get it. Uh, and hopefully it suits the viewers and if you still have any comments regarding the recording and, and uh, if you have tips on how it can look even better just let me know in the comments other than that i say uh, thank you very much for now and i'll see you back shortly